In this video, we will discuss the definition of a group. In previous videos, we've discussed pairing a set with a binary operation that may possess certain properties. These properties include inverse elements, identity elements, associativity, and commutativity. For example, the set of integers under the operation of addition has the identity element 0 and the property that each integer has an inverse. The binary operation of integer addition is both associative and commutative. The set of integers without 0 contains a multiplicative identity and is both associative and commutative, but does not have an inverse element for any element that is not the element 1. Also, Addition on natural numbers is both associative and commutative, but has no identity element and therefore no inverse elements. Knowing about these sets and their binary operation pairs, we can now define a very important quantity in mathematics, the group. Let G be a set paired with a binary operation dot from G cross G to G. Denote this set binary operation pair by g dot. This pair g dot is called a group if the following properties hold. Property 1 is the identity property. The set g must contain an identity element e with respect to the binary operation dot. The second property is the inverse property. Every element a in the set g must have an inverse, and that inverse must also be an element of G. The third property is the associativity property, which states that the binary operation dot must be associative. Any set and binary operation pair that satisfies these three requirements is known as a group. Additionally, any group that also satisfies the property that the binary operation dot is commutative is called a commutative group or an abelian group. We will discuss more about groups and provide examples of groups in future videos, but for now the definition will suffice.